There is no depth to anything that you are saying. You drank water? Yes, me too. And then I have to take a piss. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today we're going to react to Ralph Smart, what I eat in a day as a vegan. I can't believe I never reacted to Ralph Smart before. Let's do this. I'm really hungry, deep divers. <laughs> of course. And you're there thinking, has anybody gotten Ralph some breakfast yet? And Ralph is like, no. Nobody has gotten me breakfast yet. Because we ain't even Ralph. had breakfast yet, deep divers. No, we haven't. Oh, so fake. All right, interruption right there. I remember Ralph Smart from way, way back, five or six years ago, where Ralph Smart was spewing new age beliefs and still does. He was talking about meditation, about lucid dreaming, veganism, and whatnot. All of those new agey belief systems. However, back then he still seemed genuine. Back then he still seemed energized and actually motivated and actually it seemed like he believed what he was saying right now everybody can see right through him he is faking it he is lying for the camera for the clicks wow he looks dead <laughs> peace infinite mm. waters diving deep once again beautiful deep divers we are out here in nature baby uh -huh. you can hear those beautiful birds singing we're just woo, breathing in that good ass prana baby <laughs> still i'm sending you tons of bananas figs and avocados deep divers i don't take want that them. take that take no. that it is the seven day vegan challenge mm -hmm. that's right Eat to live, deep divers. Don't live to eat. But Ralph, that's exactly what we do. We eat steaks so we can live. When I was a vegan, all resolved around food, constantly thinking of it, constantly starving. I was truly living to eat as a vegan. That is the vegan ideology. Absolute food obsession because you are starving. Now, a lot of people always ask me, what do you eat in a day, Ralph? I'm so curious because I know you're doing this plant-based thingy. Yes, deep divers. I've been on the plant-based journey for over 15 years. And you call it a journey as I see. And that is probably what it is. A journey to being plant-based. Nobody believes you, Ralph, that you've been a vegan for 15 years. No chance. I've been a vegan no. and changed my life forever. <laughs> The I only bet. thing, though, mine too. I'm kind of hungry right now because <laughs> we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? Yeah. But okay, I really do not understand how anybody is still following this guy. The fakeness is cringy. It is just too much. You are trying to sell emotions, and for some lost souls, apparently it still works. All you try to do is convey good, positive vibes with no further reflection. It is absolutely disgusting to see this is what the new age is. It is a really great video to respond to because we can attack veganism and the new age movement at once. Now, I've inspired millions to go plant-based and I'm millions. happy to do that every single day. You it sure? is the best decision <laughs> I've made in my entire life to really just start eating to live because... Like my food mentor, Dr. Sebi, taught me, <laughs> our bodies are electrical. Therefore, we have to be eating electrical plant-based foods. <laughs> Dr. Sebi has been debunked 10,000 times. Deep divers. Every divers. 35 days. He's doing the Osho thing. Divers. Days, your body makes your skin makes cells. Cells. From the food you are eating. We oh, get what a is whole this? Speed new it up, man. Skin cells every 35 days. Yeah. You get a new liver every five months. Oh. You get That's not true. new bones every 10 years. And it's all based around the kinds of foods you are eating. Yeah, very true, Ralph. We need building blocks. 
we need cholesterol, we need protein, we need collagen, all of it you can find in animal foods. You are literally what you eat. Mm. What? So you're a banana. <laughs> Slow motion this side. Mm. Oh, so cringy, man. So <laughs> let me share with you deep divers. Uh. What's helped me along my journey? What? All right, so you're made out of radishes, peas, tofu, and beetroot. Makes sense. I eat in a day. I get up around five or six o'clock, depending if the cat down the road has woken me up or not, deep divers. And I'm just, woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Like literally, I am a breatharian. That's all I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just inhaling that good ass prana, baby. And that is... Yeah, I'm a breatharian too, between meals. My nutrition. And then I'm drinking lots of infinite waters. That's right. Cheers, Ralph. I am drinking a lot of water. Now, my aim every single day... Dude, how long can you drink a what I eat in a day video? It's insane. ...is to drink over one gallon of water. Drink a gallon of water, okay? Why? Water can be very dehydrating, especially if you combine it with plant-based foods and the lack of animal fats. Didn't you notice every time you drink water, you piss it out again? This is dehydration. Only water that stays in your cells is truly hydrating. Raw foods such as meats, but fruits as well for the vegans out there are very hydrating. Water is just to moisturize your lips. It has nothing to do with hydration. Every single day. So as soon as I wake up, I'm really cleansing my whole body by <laughs> drinking a lot of water and not just any water deep divers, not tap water. Your body is cleansing itself. You do not need to put water in for your body to cleanse out. Water full of fluoride. I'm drinking spring water, okay? Wow. I'm drinking Amazing. Alkaline water, which has pH 9 and pH 10, because we have to be keeping our bodies alkaline. Yes, and this is why our body has buffering systems. Our body balances out its pH level. Do you really believe that you have to drink specific water to stay alkaline? Vegan logic. Mucus <laughs> is one of the biggest causes of dis-ease. Mucus is actually healing you. You need mucus for healthy membranes. I know you read Arnold Errett and Dr. Sebi. They are promoting this vegan bullshit. And if your body is too acidic, if you have a lot of mucus, <laughs> you have a lot of dis-ease. So no, that's actually when you're healthy. Keeping the body alkaline is key to having health in your body. And you can do this by drinking a lot of spring water. That's what I do. As soon as I wake up, I'm drinking a lot of water. Now, water. I need to go to the toilet right now. So I do that <laughs> deep divers, okay? What? A lot of people wake up. Oh man, you are so blind. Again, the blind leading the blind. Infinite waters. What are you talking about? New age crap. There is no depth to anything that you are saying. You drank water? Yes, me too. And then I have to take a piss. Why? Because it is dehydrating. Simple as that. Oh, my throat is so dry, Ralph. Oh. With a dry throat. Thirsty. Real thirsty. You haven't even had a drink yet, have you? No, you haven't. <laughs> Did you know deep divers that when you are thirsty, when you are thirsty, you are already dehydrated? So yes. make sure you are hydrating yourself. And that's what I do as soon as I wake up. So now it's like- Hydrate yourself with raw animal foods. How about sashimi? Most hydrating food on this planet. Like around nine o'clock in the morning. Okay. And what am I eating? I'm still not eating a lot of solid foods, but I am drinking a delicious green juice smoothie <laughs> every single day, Congrats. consisting of pears, apples, spirulina, a complete <laughs> source of protein. Spirulina is super toxic for you. It is the worst thing that you can put into your body. The rest is just sugar. No, it's not a complete protein. Chlorella powder. Disgusting. inside there as well mm. 
complete source of protein, more <laughs> protein than beef, over 60% protein. Yes, more protein than beef. The steak that I just ate weighed around about 300 grams. Try eating 300 grams of spirulina. Good luck. It's what I call the green stuff, okay? Hemp powder as well. Yeah, stuff. Complete source Not of food. protein, vitamins and vitamins and minerals. So <laughs> I am consuming vitamins and minerals. Still lacks pretty much all the building blocks you need. No cholesterol, no vitamin A, no vitamin D, no vitamin K2, no nothing. I think a delicious green juice smoothie. I put some flax seeds on top. Highly I put estrogenic. Some seeds on top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I feel fantastic. How sure you do? I don't actually eat that much deep divers. Mm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, once I've done that, fake smile after fake smile. I'm getting smile. ready for my main meal of the day. Okay. Mm. After that green juice smoothie. Mm -hmm. The main meal of the day is what I call the Ralph Smart Special. Wow. I like... Con For a guy that is so enlightened and so egoless, he's talking quite a bit about himself. Assuming forbidden rice, okay, that black rice, it's got all the nutrients, minerals and vitamins you need. All the anti-nutrients. <laughs> With an avocado salad. Wow. The salad I love is arugula, watercress, which is one of the most nutrient dense vegetables <laughs> on the planet. Full of yeah, is that so? Please list the nutrients. <laughs> the oxidants, vitamin A, it's got everything you need. Wow, what a liar you are, Ralph. Vitamin A, really? Vitamin A is only found in animal foods. The plant equivalent is beta keratin. Plants do not have vitamin A. Stop lying to your audience. Vitamin C? Yeah, and that's all. This salad also has kale, a complete source of protein. What? <laughs> and also oregano, which is fantastic for keeping your body alkaline. Sure. And I also so use insane. also use coconut oil, sometimes virgin olive oil, okay? Mm. Not vegetable oil. That's terrible, man. Olive oil, okay? Yeah. Or avocado. It is vegetable oil, dude. Cardo oil. Yeah, still vegetable oil. And that's really what keeps me going. <laughs> yeah, because you're craving animal fats. Simple as that. And I feel fantastic, deep divers. Yeah, sure. Okay. But your eyes are crying. After that amazing salad. Sometimes I even eat a spelt pizza. Wow. Or a pizza. Yes, vegans do eat pizza, deep divers. And sometimes you eat a steak. A pizza which is made out of teff, okay? Teff is an ancient grain. When I was in Ethiopia, I actually oh. ate a lot of injera, which is also Ugh. consisting of a lot of teff, okay? Mm. Teff is a fantastic gluten-free grain. Mm -hmm. And I love eating teff. I also love buckwheat. And Great. buckwheat is not actually a grain. It's actually a fruit seed. Okay, yeah, so I love a, seed. a buckwheat salad as well. Mm. Sometimes I eat pasta, but not really because I don't like wheat. Mm -hmm. Wheat has a lot of gluten and they call it gluten because it actually glues your intestines together. Mm. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. So once I've had a really hearty meal. Okay, so that is not true either. I'm not saying that you should eat gluten, but it doesn't glue your intestines together. Man, where do you get this stuff? Anyways, this is something that vegans do realize. Gluten is bad. Certain wheats are bad. Grains are not great for you. In the end, it always boils down to the same conclusion. Plant foods, most of them, pretty bad. Animal foods, great. Deep divers. I have what I call a little vegan snack, okay? And that usually is a piece of chocolate. Cacao, okay? Over 80%, okay? Did you know Deep Divers Cacao is fantastic? It's full of tryptophan. It's a neurotoxin as well. Which produces a lot of serotonin. Just like coffee. Which makes us feel better about ourselves. Because it is a neurotoxin. It's a drug. Also, cacao is full of iron. <laughs> also, it's full of 
Nothing. Yes. Exactly. What else? Vitamin E. <laughs> yeah. It is full of brain fog, bro. It has everything you need. Magnesium, right? So chocolate is so underrated. So sad. And I've got a sweet tooth, deep divers. Just a piece of chocolate. Can I do that, please? Yes, you can. Okay. Right? I love chocolate. Dark chocolate. Deep divers. <laughs> what is this, man? And I'm still drinking it this time. Then I actually Why go for like, like a herbal tea around four or five o'clock. Okay, I love actually drinking burdock tea, which actually helps keep the body alkaline. Okay, <laughs> it's fantastic for removing toxins. What's toxins though? If you're eating such a healthy diet and you're living this super spiritual lifestyle, what toxins do you need to remove from your body? Honest question. From your blood, it's a blood cleanser. <laughs> okay, and mucus from your blood. And body. Hey, you have mucus in your blood. <laughs> nice. It is fantastic. Also, fantastic. chamomile tea. I love mm. drinking that. It really keeps me calm. Oh, just damn. so I can woo, breathe in that good ass prana, baby. Yeah, we get it. And I'm still drinking a lot of water. Uh -huh. So I'm going to the toilet a lot, deep divers. <laughs> <laughs> Again, how often do I have to repeat this? You are pissing out everything. Water is not hydrating. Animal fats are hydrating. Water that is in those raw foods is hydrating. Water is not. You are constantly dehydrating yourself and you're fueling your body with sugars. This is why you have a sweet tooth. And that's it. That's all I eat. Congrats. And in the evening times, sometimes I eat, sometimes I don't. When I do eat, I am taking a power smoothie. Because I only actually eat one main meal a day, deep divers, and that's usually the shit up. forbidden rice or brown rice. Forbidden rice. Avocado <laughs> salad. It's probably called forbidden rice because the husk are still intact. All the anti nutrients are in the husk. Okay, avocados are packed full of lutein, which are fantastic, which is fantastic for actually preventing macular wow. degeneration, good for your eye health. Mm. Also, I love coconuts. Liver is great for your eye health. Which are packed full of lauric acid, boosting the immune system. And in the evening, I love having a power smoothie. Sometimes I have the Ralph Smart power smoothie. The Ralph Smart. I call it Superman, right? Mm. And it's a maca smoothie. Maca powder is actually the, Peru the Peruvian the perversion listen man it is really sad to see and you see it in all of those new age gurus they are talking about themselves all the time the ralph smart smoothie the superman super smoothie it is all empty empty words that you are slurring trying to sell emotions to people that are deeply hurt those are the people that gravitate towards veganism and towards new ageism it is always the same clientele you are capitalizing on those poor people instead of really helping them sad peruvian ginseng i've always been drinking this and it's really helped me uh, okay with what the peruvian ginseng so this maca powder smoothie consists of maca powder figs Dates, more sugar, coconut water, bananas, avocado, cayenne pepper. Disgusting, man. Ginger. What Why else? Why are you talking Ralph? like that? Blueberries. Yeah, I just throw everything in the blender, right? But it is amazing. It really makes me feel powerful, and that's it. Powerful. So I actually start the day off with water. Then I have some superfoods, spirulina. Super chlorella <laughs> green juice smoothie this is the biggest marketing scam of all times this is how they sell you those mediocre plant foods by labeling them superfoods the real superfoods are steaks then i'm having one main meal a day avocado brown rice salad or forbidden rice <laughs> or a teff pizza or kamut pizza or quinoa pizza with vegetables on top or just junk food with olives on top Okay, then I'm having a piece of chocolate, okay, full of magnesium, <laughs> which is gonna really calm my nerves, right? Oh, you need to then calm I'm your nerves. Having a power Superman smoothie in the evening, okay, which has got a lot of maca powder, a mm. lot of maca powder, bananas inside, figs, dates. 
Stimulants and sugars. And... We get it. Coconut water. Also full of potassium. Bananas as well, full of potassium, giving you strength during the day. Bananas have less potassium than a cup of coffee. Nothing special about bananas. And deep divers, I actually stop eating at 8 o'clock. Oh, you can't eat? No, I can't eat. After 8, I really stop. Now I'm no saint. Sometimes I actually eat at 12 o'clock at night, deep divers, because I'm human, right? But I always aim at 8 o'clock at night, nothing should be in my mouth. Every day, I forgot to mention, you already know this though, I wake up with a whole bunch of grapes in my mouth, full of resveratrols, good for my heart health, deep dive. You wake up with grapes in your mouth. Is that some sort of analogy that I don't understand? I can literally live off grapes. No, you can't. The doctor <laughs> thought something was wrong with me because I just used to eat grapes. Yeah, there is something wrong with you. Again, this is Dr. Morse, grape fasting. This is the vegan brainwashing. There is something wrong with you because guess what? Nobody can simply live off grapes. You can't either. Okay. <laughs> no, not okay. Grapes are fantastic for really- <laughs> For what? Cleansing your entire body. Full of risk. Vegans are obsessed with cleansing because they are poisoning themselves with their food. Everything that you listed has a ton of anti-nutrients. Now you feel you have to cleanse yourself. If you would eat the right foods in the first place, you would have no need for cleansing. Veritrol is good for your heart health. Strawberries. I love strawberries with a passion. With a passion. Full of vitamin C. More wow. vitamin C than oranges. That's all you're getting. Those plant foods have only vitamin C and some water. That's it. And I love blueberries with a passion as well. When I'm going about my business, I always say, Ralph, keep your body light. Okay, I like to eat light foods, deep divers, fruits, mm. cucumbers, pears, watermelons, not so much, but I love papaya a lot. Okay, I love guava, okay? Great. I love eating foods which have a high water content. Cucumbers uh, over 90% water. Blueberries over 80% water. Exactly. And that is great for hydration, but that is not great for nutrition. There is nothing else in there. A little bit of vitamin C and the rest is water. That's it. And this really, I'm getting a two for one. Mm. Right? At least now it makes sense that this channel is called Infinite Waters. And that's what I do every single day. I get a two for one. Mm. Like, I love eating coconuts and also using coconut oil, right? So that's how I do it. So there okay. you have it, deep divers. That's what I eat in a day. And cool. I can't forget about nuts. I love Brazil nuts. Oh, it never I ends. Vitamin E. I love almonds. I love almond milk. Do I eat cheese? No, because I'm a vegan, but I do eat vegan cheese once in a blue moon. I do not eat mock meats, right? I don't like tempeh or soy. I don't like that stuff. And that's why I look 18. Deep divers. No, you don't. Are you hungry? I'm all right. You're already eating. I ate. And that's why. Feels so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful More deep divers. Soul We're just fake. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. I'm what sending you tons of grapes right now. Take that, take that, take that. I don't want them. <laughs> Shout out to everybody. To everybody who's been getting the amazing good ass prana shirts. At ralphsmart.com. Okay, we're going to cut it off clothes. here. Bye. All right. And this is it. Super long video as it is. So I'm not going to expand my outro statement here for too long. However, I just have to repeat yet again. This is a very sad display of absolute spiritual deception. In Christian orthodoxy, this is called prelest. Spiritual deception that is taken over a person's mind. He uses it for business, of course. He's selling it to the gullible masses absolutely disgusting absolutely fake everybody that has some brain left can see through it however we already know that vegans experience brain shrinkage and hence cannot see 
through this deception. Veganism is the doctrine of devils. Ralph Smart is promoting it. All right, guys, but this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, leave it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. And if you want to support the channel, guys, all the links are in the description box below. If you want raw grass-fed liver, but you cannot stand the taste, Grassland Nutrition has the solution. Grassland Nutrition takes grass-fed organic beef liver raw and freeze dries it for you. It is a convenient, fantastic way to get the nutrition of liver without the taste. So we have Amazon links for you. You can head over there, buy whatever you might want to buy, and it doesn't cost you anything extra. We get a small share. That is a fantastic way to support Bobby's perspective. If you want grass-fed beef delivered to your doorstep, butcher boxes for you. And we have CBD links as well. On top of that, guys, consider supporting Bobby's Perspective through Subscribestar or Patreon. We have a VIP community there where we have Skype group calls every single week where we can discuss any topic, no matter if it is health, lifestyle or nutrition related. On top of that, by joining, you straight away receive your comprehensive nutrition guide. It is an ebook that teaches you the basics of nutrition, but goes beyond as well and is catering to your personal goals, no matter if you're keto, primal, paleo, or even raw. All right, but this is it for today. Thank you very much for your support, guys. And as always, much love and peace.